So I'm uh, Barnaby Lennon. I'm standing in the School of Education at the University of Buckingham. Um, and I just want to speak for a few seconds about why I believe that it's a great thing to become a school teacher. Um, I took the decision to become a school teacher when I was um, just leaving university. And I'm sure that my parents were keen for me to become a, a lawyer or to go and work in the city. But I took the decision to become a teacher and um, I can honestly say that that was the best decision that I could have taken. And the, you know, the things that I really liked about teaching, and I taught for over 35 years, were first of all because I loved my subjects. I read geography at university and uh, I was enthralled by my subject um, and was delighted to be able to teach it uh, at uh, secondary schools of different types um, and to be part of a community of other people who had similar academic interests. Um, and I actually spent quite a lot of my summer holidays for certainly the, the first 15 years of my teaching career reading about my subject and um, becoming more involved in it. Secondly, I loved part of being part of the sort of community that uh, all schools are. Um, and as time went on, I became involved in all sorts of uh, aspects of school life that had never occurred to me when I began, including things like you know, pastoral care and sports and activities of one sort or another, and then leadership responsibilities, becoming head of department, and so on. Um, and then finally, and most importantly for me, the great thing about being a teacher is that you make such a difference to individual children's lives. And that's in great contrast to many of my colleagues from school and university who went into jobs which were no doubt much more highly paid than being a teacher, but who, as they look back now over their lives, realise that you know, what they did, although it may have been financially beneficial, was not necessarily as worthwhile. Um, one of the things that's astounded me in the last five years is how many of my former pupils, who are now maybe in their 40s or even in their 50s, um, are contacting me and inviting me out for lunch, um, simply to say, um, thank you for the impact that you had on my life when I was 16 or 17, say. And there's no doubt that you know, all teachers of all types, primary and secondary, find this, that they, whether they know it or not at the time, are making a big impact on children's lives. Um, so it's a really worthwhile occupation. There are obviously some disadvantages. You, you're not going to be rich, but on the other hand, um, you know, a, lot of, a lot of teachers are earning 40, 50, 60,000 pounds after just a few years in the job as they gain promotion. Head teachers are very well paid these days, um, but you're not going to earn as much uh, as a merchant banker. And the other thing to say, and that is that I think that for all teachers, if you're teaching classes where, where the behaviour is poor, then it is a miserable job. And so it's very important for all teachers to not only learn how to maintain good control, but also when you're applying for a job to make sure that you go to schools where you're certain that the behaviour is something that's well under control. Um, but uh, from my point of view, teaching has been you know, the best possible job in the world and I strongly encourage everybody who's interested in teaching and in the subjects that they're going to teach to apply.